Hi everyone and welcome to this video on which we embark on a mini cruise to Amsterdam from Hull. Here we begin at Leeds City Bus Station to find our Caledonian coach which is going to take us to Hull to get the ferry to Rotterdam and then to Amsterdam. We're waiting now in the coach station, Leeds coach station, um, for our bus to Hull. Um, it should have been at 3 o'clock, it is now um, 15 or 8. If you are coming here, just know that there's actually no announcements or times on the board. Basically, it's kind of its own thing, it's not tracked, so... The, yeah. the National Express buses are, which we're not getting, we get a Cal Can or Caledonian um, bus. People seem to be getting all over. We have no idea what's going on. So here we are, finally on the coach. The driver went to the wrong side of the coach station. <laughs> When we arrived at the port, we had no idea of what was going to happen. We had had no information from the booking company whatsoever. So here's what did happen. The bus driver parked up and requested that all of our passports were handed over. This was a little bit scary, um, but after an hour, he came back with our passport, boarding pass and room key. We then drove around the corner, got off the bus and got our possessions and then walked through security. We were not stopped. You could have brought anything on this boat. It was a bit of a maze finding our way around, even though the boat is actually quite small. Here I am, dancing along to the music, trying to find our way to our room. Hi, and welcome to our very small, cosy room. This tall will not take long. No, here's the bed. Here's the bed. Here's the bunk. Here's the other bunk line for uh, on the short straw. Here's, here's ladders to get to said bunk. Um, here's our clothes storage. <laughs> <laughs> the shower. And bathroom. In terms of plugs, we've got a normal UK plug socket and two USBs. So we're back in the cabin, we've just had uh, dinner. <laughs> we went to um, the Oli Kini, we decided to give that a try. It was £25. The World pound. Buffet, I mean, I've got the receipts. The somewhere. World Buffet, it was £25 per person. The other option, there's only two dining options on board. The second option is like an a la carte, is that how you say it? A la carte. A la carte. A la carte. A la carte, which we decided not to try. Because it was like £22, I mean. So yeah, £25. I did try and get one to film more of that, but it was pretty busy, pretty hectic, so... It was chaos. We didn't get too much, and it's a bit awkward filming when it's that busy and... Oh no, we got plenty of food. But it was awkward filming when there's that oh, many yeah, people, yeah, especially but, yeah. the selections available and stuff. But yeah, it was alright. We had soup, uh, curry, and a dessert. We had some nice crumble, 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 and some ice cream, so it was alright. And drinks. It? Soft drinks are included in that price. Which is uh, not bad for a buffet, really. No, it's not. Hot, hot drinks are also included. Unfortunately, there was no decaf, um, and we, we both drink the decaf after a certain time, otherwise we won't sleep. So um, The plan now is just to chill out for yeah. a bit, and then Hayley wants to go and see a film um, on the onboard cinema at half past nine. So we've, uh, yeah, we're just about to set up the top bunk now, so let's see how that goes. Which is look. So I was under the assumption that this second bed would be made or, or dropped down by a professional. I've just read the instructions that are on the wall over there. Turns out it's not the case. It's up to us to do it. I have never done this. Jamie has definitely never done this. So this is going to be interesting. So, I assume... Oh, God. Oh, God. I assume that I do this. Okay. So far, so good. Is that how secure? I, how am I not going to fall out? Bunk ladders. Hook the ladder over the bedside here. For safety reasons, do not use as a child. How am I not going to fall? Oh, wait. There's like a little... <laughs> <laughs> Let's hope the ship's not a rocking. How come you get two pillows and I only get one? The bed is made and I'm just testing it. Um, and this is where I'm gonna die. Touch wood, please, God. <laughs> but this is where I'm gonna die. 
Uh, first thing is the um, horror movie light. <laughs> the second thing is that there's, um, I'd say that's probably a good a good two inch gap on that end of. The oh, sorry. <laughs> Ow! I'm five foot two. I don't think you would have fit up here, Jamie. Six foot. <laughs> <laughs> That'd be fun to try. <laughs> Okay, so cinema plan is cancelled. Um, Eight pound fifty the ticket each, not each. together. So we're He's just very now. Very clear about that, Jimmy asked. Yeah, eight pound fifty each. Not pence. Mostly on ships, it tends to be free to the cinema. So it was surprising that there was a charge. Eight pound fifty is a little bit more than what we want to pay our man. Well, we so didn't pay that. We don't even pay that at home. We pay. I think it's like six ninety nine at the view, or like less than that actually. So we're just having a walk around the sun deck now, getting a bit of fresh air. There's some really good bands playing, so we'll check out um, what other entertainment the ship has to offer and uh, catch up with you in a bit. After wandering around the ferry, we decided to choose Music Bingo as the evening's entertainment. This was fantastic and fun, and the song selection was excellent. We actually did well enough to win a round of free drinks, which you can see Haley claiming here. Good morning everybody, we had a really good night's sleep. These beds are really comfortable, the room was pitch black. The only downside is that we did get awakened at 7am by the captain. So the only gripe is that the instructions as to what we're doing are not actually very clear. We have an inkling that we have, that we have to be off the ship by 9am, but nothing about that is concrete. We actually tried ringing up the travel agency before we came on the trip to see if we're gonna be in the same room tonight we don't actually know that so we're basically packing up as if we are leaving and in a different room and then we're going to go from there thankfully um, we've got costa t to uh, keep us going so uh, let's get uh, packed up and explore amsterdam we're here in the lounge so we just had the announcement that we could leave our cabin it turned out that we did have a black suitcase on our boarding card so we could leave our items in the um, cabin so that means that we've just got one rucksack with like our coats and water and stuff in for the day which makes life a lot easier however it would be very nice if Caledonian could have just sent us a pdf on the book saying this is what time you need to be here what's going to happen what happens when you leave and, and things like that because we've had to literally figure out everything by ourselves and at the minute you can't see but it's like chaos around here because there's people you know people are, are lorry drivers uh, motorbike uh, cyclists um, caravans it turns out uh, people that are getting off and not getting back on people are getting off and getting back on so it's all just a little bit hectic so as is the fashion for this holiday we're basically just kind of getting told things as we need to know them so we just sat we have one announcement saying that um car drivers and stuff are getting off and then some guy just comes up to us and he's like are you off to uh, amsterdam no he we we went you're a foot passenger and we're like maybe we're, we're off to amsterdam <laughs> and um he's like you've got to go now so here we are the same coach which took us from Leeds City Centre to Hull was available to take us from Rotterdam to Amsterdam. These were the same people that we boarded on the ferry with and the same coach driver. First stop, Pancakes. Right now, we're at um, a pub called Cafe 40. Cheers, enjoying a nice little beer. Birthday drink. Birthday drink. Is this a pint? We had a whole debacle about trying to order a pint in a European pub. Apparently, it doesn't exist. But anyway, here we go. Good morning. So, this is the morning after the pub where you last saw us and we didn't film last night because we really didn't do that much. We were both quite tired so we basically just got back and then spent the night on the bunk beds reading and uh, relaxing. So not 
too much exciting stuff going on. So we're just about to disembark now and check out. So we're going to leave you there and say thank you for watching this video. If you enjoyed it, then please don't forget to subscribe and click like if you enjoyed this. See you next time.